Tristram is safe. I travel to Chaldeum, the great city of the East. It has fallen before one of the last lords of hell, Belial. I mean to set the city free. Here we are, Chaldeum, Jewel of the East. Uncle Deckard loved this place. He wouldn't now that it is under the spell of Belial, Lord of Lies. I can smell his stench on the air. We'll have to separate. You two search for Belial, while I track down Magda and make her pay for Cain's death. Tell me, God, why are all these refugees here? I am not a god. I am a Shira, commander of the Iron Wolves. We saved these refugees from Magda's coven. It even now wreaks havoc throughout the borderlands. I have been hunting Magda all the way from New Tristram. Where can I find her? She's heading toward Alcarnas, but has blocked the road behind her. However, there is another way. Through the Kasim outpost. Emperor Hakan threw his entire court out of the city. Teriel and I learned that while the Iron Wolves were fighting Magda in the desert, the Emperor replaced them with Imperial Guards who bar all from the inner city. I suspect that the Iron Wolves were sent out to die. Belial has made his move. We must find a way into the city. As a child, I explored Chaldeum while Uncle Deckard studied here. I can get in through the sewers. Good. Learn what you can. We'll reconvene after I've killed Magda. Be careful. Alcarnas sounds like Magda's trap. This gate leads to Alcarnas. You will need to follow the long road over the canyon bridge and through the Kasim outpost. Take heed, traveler. Cultists guard these desert roads, and they will slay any who pass. I've heard. I traveled here to kill them and their leader. Then you must not go alone. I shall accompany you. There are illusions out there. Mirages to some. But I can see them for what they are. The Coven's foul magic. They will lead you to your death. Thanks for the warning, but I know a trap when I see one. I would rather not discuss the Sand Wasp. These overgrown insects wouldn't be notable whatsoever if not for their exceptionally poisonous stings, which, alas, killed my young apprentice. I thought he would be more careful when I sent him to retrieve a sample from the hive, but <laughs> his parents did not understand my perspective. The Lacuni, or Panther men, as they are sometimes called, have inhabited the desert wastes east of Chaldeum for thousands of years. The large males are the tribe's leaders and protectors, while the agile females are expert hunters. Mostly they are primitive and reclusive creatures, although they will attack if cornered or hungry. Be careful. They are very near to us. What do you mean? The road is blocked. You should never have come! Demons were faced on your bones! How did you know about the ambush? I am an enchantress. The ways of magic and illusion are familiar to me. My name is Arena. My thanks, Arena. It seems you are doing a lot more than saving travelers, though. Well, I am also looking for someone. But here, let me clear the way for you. Captain, from behind! Protect the people! Iron Wolves! If not for you, the Lacuni would have eaten well this day. 
Well, I need to slaughter more Lacuni on my way to Alcarnus. Ha! Those beasts are nothing compared to the cultists. They're casting spells in two of their desert lairs to obscure the Black Canyon Bridge. Let us head north to the Howling Plateau. The cultist magic seems to be emanating from there. There is another illusion here. The cultists tried to hide their footsteps, but their spells are weak and easily countered. If we follow these prints, we can find their lairs and halt the rituals. I will seek out any other traces of their magic. It seems that the Fallen are indeed creatures of demonic origin. The old Haradric tale claims they were once powerful servants of the mythical Asmodai. They purportedly aided him in his battle against... Look! More hidden footprints! for that creature to die. Seventeen demons are Belial's favored servants, and he has granted them some of his skill in cunning and illusion. Deceivers will cloak themselves in the familiar forms of their I enemies' companions and friends, waiting to strike when the moment is opportune. It is only then that their true forms are revealed. This is one of the cultist lairs. They are casting part of the illusion inside. Ritual is disrupted. My training has paid off. This should remove part of the illusion. Look, more hidden footprints. Revenge. Look, more hidden footprints. Though the champions are larger and the lunatics more devastating, it is the shaman priests who lead the fallen. These shrunken, unintimidating demons can easily kill an enemy with their firebolts, but it is their ability to resurrect their imp allies that allows them to command- Look, more hidden footprints.
This Dune Thresher is an elusive being with a tremendous capacity for bloodshed. This is one of the cultist's lairs. They are casting part of the illusion inside. There, that ought to dispel the coven's magic. Let us go to the bridge. Tell me, what shall you do when Magda is dead? I will kill her master Belial and his brother Asmodan. The long shadows of the Lords of Hell will be lifted from this world. How curious. You must be the one I was meant to find here. I think it is time for you to know my true tale. I am not from Chaldeum. I learned these spells 1500 years ago. My sisters and I pledged our service to a man of great power. We called him the Prophet. He trained us and placed us in a magical slumber to awaken in this era. I am to prevent the Lords of Hell from invading. I would scarcely believe it if I hadn't seen your spells with my own eyes. You must have waited for this even longer than I have. Please, join me. The Kasim outpost can't be far. The hounds are distracted. They will take no notice of me. From the gods, the cult has thrown me down here as a plaything for their sh Please take this for saving me. It is the least I can do. This is no illusion. The cultists block the road. I'll have to go through the Kasim outpost to the west. Revenge!
satisfying. It is with some reluctance that I write on the seven lords of hell, for they are the greatest of the demons, and even whispering their names seems to poison the air around me. They are divided into the lesser evils, Belial, Asmodan, Duriel, and Andariel, and the prime evils, Mephisto, Baal, and Diablo. Captain of the Guard. You are hereby ordered to send a band of your most loyal men to secure the Kasim outpost. Control of the city hangs by a thread. The commoners are becoming restless, and it is imperative that we subdue them. Remain vigilant, for there may already be an outsider within our borders looking to stir up trouble. I need to reach Alcanus. Please open the gate. You must be mad, but if you're intent on rushing headlong to your death, talk to Captain David down in the command post. He's got the gate key. Here you are, delivered unto me as a sacrifice, a gift from Lord Belial. Really, Magda? Or did Belial send you here as bait to lure me away from Chaldeum? I will kill you, you know. No! He would never betray me! Strike her down! Belial is the Lord of Lies, Magda. The truth is, you were dead the minute you killed Cain. Not a moment too soon. They plan to sacrifice us to Belial. Iron Wolves, take back the town! Has Magda reached Alcarnus? Yes. We've heard rumors of a horrible slaughter there. Then I cannot delay any longer. Open the gate. Cain's death will soon be avenged. I can bring that down.
Your fear betrays you! Belial, Lord of Lies, is the most elusive of the seven evils and is a master of deceit. It is said that he manipulated Asmodan into revolt against the prime evils. This began the Burning Hell's civil war, which ended with the dark exile of the prime evils to our mortal realm. Don't worry, I'm here to free you. I can't believe it's over. The gods have answered my prayers. I must escape. become stronger. Your fate is sealed, Magda. The chase ends here. It matters not. While you hunted me, Belial's Imperial Guard captured your little witch, Leah. Soon, her power shall be his.
I could do for Kane. No one else will die at Magda's hands. When I joined the Coven, it was weak and idle. The leaders were content to do nothing while the prime evils were imprisoned. I convinced another witch to help me poison them, and together we took control. She left some years later, but I continued, bringing the Coven to glory under Lord Belial. I am returning to town. As her life was slipping away, Magda claimed that the demon lord Belial would reign over our world. I will die before I let such a dark fate come to pass. Before I killed her, Magda told me that the Imperial Guard had captured Leah. I saw these guards at the Kasim outpost. They are the serpent demons of Belial, disguised as men. Then they must be holding the Emperor against his will. I tremble to think what Belial might do with Leah and her growing power. The only chance we have to rescue Leah is to wrest the Emperor from the grasp of the Imperial Guard. Ashira, the Iron Wolves captain, may be willing to help us. I will speak with her. goods today please look you won't be disappointed i am returning to town Captain Ravan, the condition- Ashira, the Emperor and my friend are in grave danger. I must gain entry into the palace. I heard what you did at Kasim Outpost in Arcanus. You have my thanks, and you shall have my help. Captain Ravan, this woman has vital information regarding the massacre in the Borderlands. We must see the Emperor at once. Very well, but I don't think you'll find him receptive. Let them pass! Perhaps a bit of coin? Would change your mind? Let's go. I'll lead you to the palace. You are bold to have sought this audience with me. My guards tell me you were responsible for the massacre of innocent villagers in Arcanus. Those are lies. Magda and her coven destroyed Arcanus in the name of Belial. If you are innocent, then why do you have spies skulking through my sewers? Bring her in! Let me go! I detest violence. Gods, I leave this matter in your hands. No! When the Crusaders had learned all they could, Akan sent them out into the world, seeking a way to cleanse the- I knew you'd come for me. We need to leave before more guards arrive. Get out of here. I will cover your escape. 
Thank you. Now we need to get to the sewers. I'll explain why when we get there. These demons are blocking our way. We must destroy their summoning construct. into the sewers from here. This leads to the sewers. I found my mother, Adria. She's alive. But the Imperial Guard is holding her somewhere down here. We will find her. That thing must die. So Magda was telling the truth. Somehow I knew my mother was alive. I always knew it. But you never knew her. Be wary, Via. Things are not as they seem sometimes. about the Black Soul Stone. We know of the three that the Haradrim used to trap the primevals. What is the purpose of this one? Your master Belial has good reason to fear it. Leave her alone. Seize them! Leah, my daughter. You know who I am? My darling, I've watched over you all your life. But I never dared get close because of the danger that always shadows me. We can't talk here. Let's get to safety first. I'm surprised Cain never told you why I left. He knew I was called to fight the Lords of Hell. And I knew he would keep you safe. He's gone now. Then it's fate that we have been reunited. Cain's work, your work, is my war. According to the Herodric texts, only two evils remain. Belial is here in Chaldeum, and Asmodan has yet to reveal himself. I have more control now. The guards were asking you about this Black Soul Stone. I remember reading about it in Uncle's journal, but it didn't seem important. No, but it is. It is the key to defeating evil forever. It was created by the mage Zoltan Kool to trap demonic souls. Yes, he was a renegade Haradrim, dismembered by his brethren before he could activate the Soul Stone. His head was sealed away in the Dolgar Oasis. We must retrieve it. Because if we're to use the Soul Stone to defeat Belial and Asmodan, Zoltan Kool must live again. I have reunited Leah with her mother, the witch Adria. She spoke to us about the Black Soul Stone. An artifact that could permanently destroy the Lords of Hell. I must find it at any cost. Murderer, torturer, monster. These were the titles bestowed upon Zoltan Kool by the Horadrim. Though it cost them dearly, they killed the wizard for his crimes against nature and sealed his broken corpse within a shadow realm. 
It seems they were afraid he might return. Disgusting! I've seen that woman going in and out of the... Listen to me. I cannot talk for long, but Lyle's guards are constantly watching me. Emperor Hakam? Forgive me for my behavior at court. The guards would have killed me had I sided with you. But I will help you now as I can. You must be headed to the Oasis. I can open this gate for you. I'm overburdened. I am returning. The deserts of Kegistan are majestic, expansive, and full of stinging swarms of insects. They may seem a minor nuisance, but these vermin carry numerous strains of pestilence. One of them was trapped in my boot once, and my foot swelled up to the size of a melon before the infection cleared. What horrible creatures! After all this time, my mother is alive. I couldn't be happier, and yet, it's still hard to accept that she never sent word to me or Uncle Deckard. She said that she wanted to keep me safe, but I just wish I'd known. Well, at least I have her now. The accursed were created when a necrotic plague spread through Kezistan centuries ago. The infected watched in terror as their flesh blackened and died. The strongest medicines could not stop the decay. Eventually, they fell into a dormant state, and their bodies were piled up in dark and forgotten places where they could rest undisturbed. Valrus manuscript lists Asmodan as the best battlefield commander of all demons. Having defeated the angels many times in the eternal conflict across Pandemonium and the prime evils in the demonic civil war, if the Lord of Sin ever assaults our realm, we truly have much to fear. To those who doubt my achievements in research, I present my findings on the Dune Dervish. It took me many years to find the truth of these strange, deadly figures. 
but my sources indicate that they are the cursed remains of mages who summoned a demon far beyond their power to control. Your fear betrays you! That was just a taste! Interesting. I have more control now. My wrath. Overwhelm the enemy and seize her companions. There is a witch among them and another, a girl. Bring them to me along with the Black Soul Stone. They will be searching for the head of Zotun Kool. Scour the oasis for it. Some old sorcery lingers on the skull, and it must be mine! You will not enter the aqueducts! Lord Belial demands you! I 
cannot open this. Centuries ago, a much smaller Chaldeum depended upon small wells for its water. Then came the mysterious Dalgur, offering Chaldeum an oasis of unparalleled splendor, located in an area previously thought to be desert, asking only that his name be permanently affixed to the land. Then... Someone help us! I must save us! Don't let us die! Thank you for saving me. Get us out of here! I must flee! I need to get out of here! to explore that cave over there for trinkets, but after that, it's all yours. This chest seems suspicious. I hunt the beasts, not the other way around. Drink no more. Fezul al Khazar promised that he would lead his followers from sinful Chaldeum to a lily strewn paradise at the heart of the desert, and that the journey would transform them beyond all recognition. Hmm. Judging by the condition of the gnawed corpses found weeks later, Fezul kept at least one of his promises.
sweet revenge. Perhaps Zoltan Kool's head lies through this portal. Most talented mages can summon skeletal guardians. It takes great power to form these tall, slim constructs from their unstable reagents, and even more power to sustain them. In the hands of a master, however, the guardians can become powerful weapons capable of defending their posts until the end of time. Not all dangerous demons are large and imposing. The dust imps are little more than children in size, but they possess the cunning and bloodlust of far larger creatures. They take cover in the shadows, emerging only when viable prey wanders too close. Then they ambush, leaving little more than bones behind them. set out in one week's time into the desolate sands to search for Kool's hidden archives. None of us have any idea what to expect. How far has Kool's madness driven him? How much power has he accumulated in his mad quest? I can only hope we are not too late. I need to go back. If you keep holding back, then you'll never improve. Ah! Leah, are you all right? Yes, I think so. I'm sorry to push you like this, but it will all be for the best in the end. I know. It is time, Leah. Cast the spell as I taught you. I live again. Zoltan Cool. We need you to activate the Black Soul Stone. We would use it to trap the last two Lords of Hell. <laughs> I know your voice, stranger. It has haunted me in death just as it commanded me in life. Tyriel. I am, but now mortal. Ah, fate is whimsical. I will give you the Black Soul Stone, but in exchange, I must be made whole once again. You were treacherous before. How do I know you won't be an even greater threat once you've been fully revived? You don't. So you must ask yourself, how much would you risk to save this wretched world? Everything. Ah, so be it. To begin. You will need to retrieve my blood from the dungeons where it has been hidden away. You will find them in the desolate sands beyond the aqueducts. I'm going to go with you. We should bring Cool's head with us. Maybe he'll have something useful to say. I'll put him in your bag. Your linen 
interesting one, aren't you? I wonder if your friends know what you truly are. What are you back? I can open this gate for you. <laughs> Emperor Hakan? I don't like the look of this place. Something was here before us. Likely demons. It's Belial. So long as he lives, all of Chaldeum is under siege. Uncle Deckard theorized that the demon lords leave demons in their wake. Much like us leaving footprints. Do you believe that? Yes. The more I study my uncle's books, the more I realize that even I took his wisdom for granted. Interesting. The electric eels are insidious pests that have taken root in the oases surrounding Chaldeum. Known for their stinging strikes, these creatures are particularly dangerous when they attack in large numbers. It is said that raw eel has become a delicacy among Chaldeum's elite, but I assure you these rumors are baseless. I want more time to explore the great library of Chaldeum when this is all over. You are more like your uncle than you know. Maybe, but they got to have books on the Black Soul Stone and Asmodan. Something that will help me understand his theories. my rod. Those corpses have quite a stench. I should have seen it. How satisfying. for lost artifacts with Uncle Deckard, even though it did have its dangerous side. I can't tell you how many times I had to drag him away from an army of skeletons because he was fixated on some dusty old tapestry.
You have sought knowledge for many years, yet you look so well preserved for your age, Adria. Just how old are you, exactly? Go to hell. Goods today, please. That's one lever down. This will be interesting. Well, I must really want you. Philosopher Cadus said, if you want to know the truth of a city, you need look no further than the state of its infrastructure. That would mean Chaldeum is based on filth and demons. Yes, and built on secrets. Passage should lead to the desolate sands. A secret door hidden behind a waterfall. How imaginative. You would do better. I can't believe he stuck me in a barrel. Really, it's quite uncomfortable in here. Are you still alive out there? Or is it the monster? It's... Thank you for releasing me. It was getting a little boring in there. Uh, 
uh, uh, I am seeking a magic crucible that legend says was hidden in these very aqueducts. <laughs> it, it would be a valuable addition to my jeweler's tools. <laughs> Help me find it, and I will be greatly indebted to you. <laughs> Oh, how rude of me. I forgot to introduce myself. Uh, my name is Covetous Shen. Covetous? Is that really a name? I can't imagine why my young partner bashed me over the head and sealed me in there. This place is quite dangerous without a knowledgeable guide. You were careless to come here in the first place. How have you lived so long? I am too beautiful to kill. <laughs> I have more control now. Uh, what a fascinating place this is. Oh, oh, look at all this wonderful architecture. You could walk all the way around the world and never find its like. Uh, except for this part. I've seen this somewhere else before. Now, I wonder where my young guide got off to. His name was Gavin, I believe. Crucible! It's mine! Uh, be careful, Gavin. It might be cursed. Uh, the Crucible should be safe now. Uh, pick it up. Pick it up. <gasps> Poor young man. If I had known the Crucible was cursed, I never would have brought him along. <laughs> If you come see me in Chaldeum, I can show you how the Crucible can combine jewel fragments. <laughs> well, you know, I've been searching for a certain jewel for a long, long time. I'm in no rush. But maybe if I go with you, I'll find it just like I found this Crucible. May I come with you on your journey and make glorious jewelry for you? I could use your services. Oh, the way out is just a little farther. I am starving. Do you think we'll find any good food down here? Here, in the aqueducts? You must be joking. Don't be ridiculous. I never joke when it comes to food. You go on ahead. I'm going back to town. I need to learn the spell needed to restore Cool's body. I'll meet you when you get to the archives. You and I are the same. But those others... The Fallen Angel, the Witch, they're using you for their own ends. You choose to be their puppet, yet the power of your birthright could make you a god. I doubt that would end well. Those who seek power are often destroyed by it. There's no need to be snide. Soon enough, I'll walk this world again. Then I'll show you what a Nephilim can achieve. lie beneath this desert, perhaps even beneath the sands we now tread upon. The Haradrim could not destroy them. They could only lock the door behind them, and I still have the key.
found Kool's archives. They were strangely empty at first, but Kool laid traps everywhere, each step harder than the next. It was foolish to expect otherwise. Kool has prepared for many years for someone to come for him. Perhaps we are fools, and yet we must push on. In here, I can feel my blood nearby. They hid some of it beyond this portal. more powerful. Do you want more? Sweet revenge! Diablo was the youngest of the prime evils, but I found him the most dangerous, for his power over terror left him incapable of feeling fear. Though he had easily possessed and corrupted many humans, Diablo's essence was finally trapped in a soul stone and vanished to the unfathomable abyss 20 years ago. was just a taste!
unlocked the secret of the soul stones once given to the Horadrum by Tyriel. An impressive creation, to be sure. But one that I am certain can be duplicated. No, not just duplicated. Improved upon. My soul stone will be made to contain the souls of many demons. Or even angels. And Ariel was the only female evil. She aided the lesser evils for many years, but eventually she lost faith in their plots. Two decades ago, she chose to help Diablo during his resurgence and seize the Citadel of the Sightless Eye. Ultimately, she perished at the hands of brave heroes. The Crusaders swore an oath to dedicate their lives to the search. None believed that they would be the one to end the Crusade by finding and cleansing the corruption. They believed the search ennobled them, that the discipline of their life and journey was the true goal. The Crusader was meant to find meaning in the quest itself. We, the Zakarum, have endeavored to make Chaldeum a city of mercy and salvation. But we have not yet been able to convince the emperors to change the ancient policy of exile. Prisoners convicted of treason are still sent to the desolate sands to die with nothing but the clothes on their backs. A challenge! I've become my heart stronger. Is full. I can't carry any more. Your fear betrays you! My pack is full. I am returning to town. Hey lady, I got some new things. You should take a look.
I can't believe what people throw away. I got some. Darkness awaits you. Some of my blood is within that cave. I can feel it. I believe with this soul stone, I will finally be able to unlock the true power of man. In ancient times, our kind possessed power unmatched in this dreary age. With the soul stone, I will be able to elevate myself to the strength of my ancestors. The rockworm may very well be the ugliest creature ever to blight the world with its presence. Bereft of any features aside from its massive jaws, the rockworm appears to be a giant invertebrate. I should like to study it further, but its burrowing tendencies make it extraordinarily difficult to track. my wrath.
archives are at the northern tip of the desolate sands. There we will find my body and the Black Soul Stone. <laughs> Entrance to my archives. Let me activate the portal. <laughs> I had to build all of this for my research and my experiments. The Black Soul Stone was a complicated creation. I sacrificed much to make it. <laughs> I got you. Beyond these portals lie two relics that were once powered by my blood. Take the vials you recovered and use them to activate the relics. I will stay here and prepare the ritual. Be careful. be impressed by all of this. Where have you been that could compare? I have looked upon hell itself in my nightmares. There is little that moves me now. Oh. Well then. you are upon us. But do you truly believe that Belial and Asmodan could have engineered these events? There are no others who would put us in such peril.
Your fear betrays you! Sweet revenge! Become Nephilim and ushered in a golden age. But my Herodric brothers could not accept man's true destiny. We will seal the Shadow Locks with vials of his blood, and we will hide the blood in the desert under eternal guard. I can only hope that the world does not forget of Kul's evil, and his blood remains undisturbed beneath the shifting sands. to lock my body away. They must have been very angry with me. You betrayed them all. Of course you were imprisoned. <laughs> they were never very imaginative. Feel my wrath! Each and every crusader was a warrior of rare strength. They had mastered the power of light, of weapon and shield, and of self. Each was sworn to live as a crusader and to die as one. Two hundred years ago, they took their apprentices and set out into the eastern swamplands. They were never heard from again. Until now. Rumors swirl that the Crusaders have returned, and that they mean to go to the West. But who are these tall, blonde warriors? They look nothing like the Crusaders who set out from Travincal 200 years ago, and those who inhabit the ruins of that ancient city suspect trickery. tasted what it is to be Nephilim. Join with me, and we can become the masters of this world. I cannot join with someone I cannot trust. Be silent. Who mocks my every step? I try to shut him out, but his chattering is ceaseless. He takes joy in taunting me. I will not rise to the bait. I will not give in to him. I long for the silence that will come once I secure his head away. I have Cool's body. Then let me begin the ritual. But I'm warning you, Cool. You'd better not cross us. You are surrounded by deceit, young one. 
I am the least of your concerns. Concentrate, Leah. Soon now, just a bit longer. Just a moment. Almost. Yes! Thunders within me! This fetid air fills my ravaged lungs! I am alive again! You're welcome. Don't forget your part of the deal, Cool. Give us the Soul Stone. Very well. The bargain stands. Quickly, to my sanctum. <laughs> my life's work. All will tremble at my power. What is this? How has this happened? The souls of the dead lords of hell have been absorbed into the stone. Abandon your quest, Nephilim. Your allies seek only to control you with the power I offer. You and I could rule over all creation. You are mad, cool. Give me the stone or I will destroy you. I can't carry any more. The wards have been triggered. It seems my brothers have finally come looking for me. Damn them. I am not ready. Too much of my power is invested in the stone's creation. I must finish it. The future of mankind depends on it. Five Lords of Hell now reside within this stone. This was your doing, Adria. Twenty years ago, during the darkening of Tristram, Cain told me of Zoltan Kuhl's profane soul stone. That's why you left me. You went to mark the demon's souls so that they could be drawn into Kuhl's vessel. Yes, my daughter. I have sacrificed everything for this. I need to go back. What shall we do after Belial and Asmodan are trapped within the Soul Stone? Then I will shatter it, and the Lords of Hell will be no more. We've got to reach the Emperor. He said he can lead us to Belial. Are you certain we can trust the child? We have no choice, but know this. If Belial gets desperate, he will unleash hell upon Chaldeum. So before we face him, we must evacuate the citizens. The Iron Wolves can help. Let's get going. Belial has started his attack on the city. Hurry! We'll keep you safe! I need more discipline. Belial is starting to panic, and he tears the city apart to stop us. When the fireballs began falling from the sky, we started evacuating the people. They will be safe here. I'll bring as many as I can find. The Iron Wolves will assist you to the death. I saw people hiding under the carts. Bring them to the sewers. Save yourself. It's the end of the world. Who has brought this wrath down upon us? I'm overburdened. What is happening? 
Not enough discipline. I never believed it would end like this. Who has brought this wrath down upon us? I am too low on discipline. Please save me! I can't die like this! Watch out! Keep the people away from those fireballs! Discipline. That was just a taste! Duriel is the twin of Andariel. I believe that they conspired together to assist Diablo in releasing Mephisto and Bale, though they had both supported the lesser evils in the past. The Lord of Pain was found guarding Bale's prison, the tomb of Tal Rasha, when he was slain I am by too heroes. Low discipline.
Not enough discipline. Now to the gates. We have no time to lose. Let's go. Now, Leah, use your power just the way I taught you and bring down these gates. Stand back. I still can't fully control it. Your master dies today! That's all of them. For the servants of Belial. That sorcerer's illusion blocks our path. Again, daughter. I I feel so weak. I I don't know if I can. You must! Now! It is up to you now. Hurry! I must stay here and tend to Leah. Praise the gods you've arrived just in time. Show me the soul stone. You'll get a good look when I trap your miserable soul within it, Belial. Clever. But know this, Nephilim. Asmodan knows of the stone and the power it contains. Even if you defeat me, he will exterminate you and every last one of your misbegotten kind. Quickly, Leah. Seal Belial's soul within the stone. It is ironic that one as twisted as Zoltan Kuhl played so great a role in our salvation. Kuhl was once a tireless enemy of hell. From his life, let us learn. The longer we fight evil, the more it can corrupt our hearts. I need to go back. Today is a good day. You have liberated this land and brought low a lord of hell. Enjoy this moment, for tomorrow our war continues.
There is no time for rest. Even now, Asmodan plots our destruction. The Lord of Sin is an uncanny tactician. He'll attack us where he believes we'll least expect it. And where defeat would break our will to resist. You are learning well, Leah. Now you must go to Chaldeum's great library and continue with your uncle's work. I can be ready to leave at a moment's notice. Let me know when you are prepared to go. Demons invasion will come from Ariane. 